Hey guys, I'm Sean. I'm Bree. This is Let's Go. Welcome. Uh, so we made it to Hogs Falls and it's in Huron County. Correction, Gray County. Seems like I have a hard time remembering which county I'm in. It's snowing just a little bit. We got some sun. Uh, we've got this beautiful river and we're on the way to a waterfall. So hit that subscribe button and ring that bell. Practicing your B-roll, guys. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Check out these ice chunks. Happy with those. Look really good. Covered in snow. By the way, pro tip when shooting out in the winter. Notice how I'm not wearing thick gloves. It's like negative 10, feels like negative 18 or something. Check it. These little guys, little hotties, they're called. Just slip right in the hand. And don't worry about your fingertips because you just grab them like this. That's a no. Let's try this way. How was that for you? Uh, snowshoes. Bring snowshoes. Good luck getting down that. Oh, we're gonna just slide down that. <laughs> oh, that's got some speed. <laughs> One more time. <laughs> no. It's super pretty. Like way prettier than we thought it was going to be. Yeah, and the colors are amazing. It's just pure white. It's half frozen over. The snow is just perfect. Slippery. But it's like really nice. Yeah. Yeah, it's the best waterfall I've seen in the winter in Ontario. Sorry, Niagara Falls. Good luck! One thing you should know about me is that I wear my shoes to death. This is what I was wearing to Hogs Falls. And they're my trusty Bunstones. I've had them for five years. I've worn these things winter, summer, fall, spring, every single season. They have no traction. Um, there's no soul left. None. There's no soul, yeah. just like you. Well, soulless creatures like Voldemort. So, I went out. <laughs> And I bought some new hiking boots, so maybe they'll be less sliding. Look at theirs, they have spikes and poles. <laughs> I already slid. I don't want to get too close to the edge. It's not that big of a drop but it would be very unpleasant and probably get some scrapes and bruises. Not worth it for this day. Sean's gonna try though. It's really upsetting to me. I should have figured, but what can you do, right? But we are in a very magical place and there's tons of stuff I could take photos of. So there is the path that leads you to the bottom of the waterfall. I attempted to do it and fell slid right down. 
Not doing that again. So Sean has a little, little bit better footwear. So he's gonna try and make it down that. Good luck to you, mate. I'm sorry. When did you become Australian? In the moment. I became Australian in the moment. It's only when you do crazy things. I just come different nationalities, the thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna try it. I, I'm not gonna bring the gimbal and, uh, and the whole setup down there. So uh, I'm probably gonna use the GoPro to do the filming from, uh, for that part of this. Just in case he falls. Just in we case just I fall. We just got food for Sean's XD4 fixed and uh, it was an expensive bill, so. Yeah, I'm, just, oh, I'm still bringing the camera with me because I'm gonna try and do a yeah, but long exposure. Yeah, in a exposure. cushy bag. In a cushy bag rather than the, uh, with, on top of the gimbal here, so. Uh, but I, for sure I'm gonna bail down that hill with this gimbal and that camera. So uh, we're gonna get out the <laughs> GoPro and I'm gonna bring that with me instead. We're gonna also bring Mikey. And we're gonna see if we can get some drone footage from down there. Yeah. Oh yeah. All right, let's go. I'm down, but I had to uh, use both hands, so I had to throw the tripod into the snow. What is that? A man's snow toe tripod? <laughs> <laughs> so nice. Got the ND filter uh, on the food chair. We're getting some beautiful photos of the waterfall, long exposures. Right now I'm gonna do about a 25 seconds. I've got F16, I did, just did a few at F11, and we'll see how that turns out. Just noticed that Brie was flying Mikey around, so she's up there getting some drone footage, so that's amazing, I can't wait to see that. There we go. All right. So I like this little line that leads right up here to the uh, the waterfall. So I can see if I can get that in the shot here with the long exposure. So it looks like Brie crashed my key, so we're gonna have to uh, give him some new propellers. Uh, but that's why they give you extra propellers, right? So I'm gonna take a couple more shots and head on up. I crashed Mikey. I forgot how to land. <laughs> Let's have a look. Oh, there's some uh, just propellers, so that's okay. The Mikey fell into the ice. It was all caked in ice, so I cut, cleared all that out and snow. And then these ones aren't moving, so hopefully that's an easy fix. And it's got a little scratch right there. First scratch for a drone is always an important one. It's an important <laughs> milestone in life. <laughs> hey, I was pretty proud of myself though. I got out there, I got some cinematic shots of the waterfall. Figure it out, we'll do what we can. It's sitting around like negative like 13 degrees without the windchill here, Celsius. We were out there for about four and a half hours. Yeah. Thank goodness for hand warmers. <laughs> yes. It was very cold. And in the next video, we discover foot warmers. Oh yeah. Good. You gotta do that Good. with your feet. Put your feet up there. I don't think I could do it with my feet actually. Oh, you're gonna do. <laughs> I also gotta do bloodstones. <laughs>
<laughs> what are you, a cricket? <laughs> That's it for us. Thanks for coming with us to Hogs Falls. We had a great time. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, uh, comment, like, hit that subscribe button. Uh, till next time, we'll see you in the next video. Let's go. How I keep warm. Processing, processing, processing. Processing, processing, processing. Grab walk. This is my processing dance. Yeah. Still processing? Yep. <laughs>